Ready and. and in this lesson video I'm going to teach you how to play a blues lead in the key of A. I'll show you a minor pentatonic scale which is uh, a great scale that you can use to play any note in a lead part. You can make it up. It's a lot easier than it sounds. And this is my band, Lee Walsh. She's going to be playing the rhythm part here. Now this is something that I've taught in an earlier lesson and I taught it in more depth. So if you feel like I'm going too fast in this lesson, check out the link underneath here and you'll be able to uh, practice with that one. Here's the A minor pentatonic scale, also known as the blue scale. It starts on the fifth fret. I'll play it slowly so you can play it with me. So make sure you're playing with your fingertips. Try it backwards. So let me review that. It's five, eight, five, seven, five, seven, five, seven, five, eight, five, eight. And you'll know that I'm going down and up with my right hand, with my pick. Now, if that was too fast, again, you want to refer back to that earlier lesson. I'll also put up a diagram of that scale. Now, if you're jamming with friends, and they're in the key of A and you're wondering what to play, well you can play any note in this scale. You can also put together some riffs in this scale and I teach that in that other video too. So here's one I'm calling riff number one and I'm starting here on the seventh fret and going down to the fifth fret and here that's where your bend is and then back here to the fifth fret. Riff number two, you're starting here on the fourth string from the bottom. So it's the same pattern, you're just starting a different place. And the other one I'm calling the Chuck Berry lick because he plays something like this in a lot of his music. And you're going to press down the first and second string on the fifth fret. And then you reach up here on this fret here, which is the seventh fret, third string. And then same string, fifth fret. And then to finish it off, you're going to reach up to that fourth string from the bottom. So it goes like this. And these riffs can be inserted anywhere to jam along with your friends. All right, so here are those riffs in the key of A. Here is riff number one. Make sure you push it up far enough in that bend to hear a different note. Then here's riff number two. And the Chuck Berry lick. Now, Lee's going to play the rhythm part, I'm going to sing it, and I'm going to play what's called fills. So the fills are going to be just uh, a few notes. I will also be playing parts of the scale because you can play parts of the scale and that will be your lead part. All right, you ready? I think so. All right. <laughs> you ain't nothing but a hound dog. Little 
little sloppy, but I was playing it on the fly, right? So you'll see that mostly I was playing those fills when I wasn't singing. We had a real steady rhythm player, which is also what you want. All right, so now we're going to jam a little bit in the key of A. So this isn't any particular song. This is just a simple 12-bar blues in the key of A. I'll be playing some of those riffs that I showed you, mixing it up a little bit, and using some of those notes that are in the scale. All right, hit it, band. <laughs> So that's a little part of what you can do when you learn to play this lead part. If it's going a little too fast, just turn off the video and practice that scale over and over again until your hands start twitching in the middle of the night. Again, uh, check out that first lesson where I teach all this stuff in a little more detail and including some close-ups in case I'm going too fast here. Check out my other lessons. I've got over 300 lessons for guitar, mandolin, and ukulele. And if you want to support the work that I do, please buy me a coffee. It's only $3 and I'll put the link somewhere in this video. You can also support me via Patreon. If you want to know more about my original music, it's at jamieanderson.com. Thanks to Lee. Thanks to all of you.